What's going on, guys? Straight from Warner Brothers Pictures, we're taking a look at the 4K Still Book of a Nightmare on Elm Street. This comes with a 4K disc and digital download code. Uh, yeah, this took forever for me to get in, guys. Um, they canceled my order on um, Walmart's website, and when I went to Amazon, uh, I said they only had a few left, and I did put my order in, and um, it didn't really say it shipped until last week. So I ended up getting it today. Um, I pre-ordered these months ago on uh, Walmart's website, and they ended up canceling, which sucked so bad. Um, but yeah, I'm happy to have it. I did end up picking up um, the regular 4K uh, release of that as well. Um, we'll pop that back there in the back. Uh, a lot cheaper. And I seen on Walmart's website... Um, I think it was like last week that these were going for like $130 for some crazy reason. But um, yeah, happy to have it. Um, let's take a look at it. Um, let's unwrap it real quick. But yeah, one of my favorite um, horror franchises. Um, I used to watch these movies all the damn time. Um, Dream Warriors, probably one of my favorite ones. Um, but yeah. Up at the top, it does say it comes with a 4K disc and digital download code. It says a limited edition still book there. You get uh, Nightmare on Elm Street there on the front, on the, well, on the spine. And uh, right here on the back, you do have uh, a read up here, and you do have your special features. And I meant the top of the J card, but there you go. And then down here, you do have your specifications. Probably a little bit hard to read in red. But you can pause and read that. And let's pop this here. Take a look at this. And here is the front. I do like that retro VHS style. You have the old Warner Brothers logo there. It says Warner Home Video there. You've got the horror sticker, which I do find a lot of VHS tapes at my local um, uh, Goodwill. And they still have the little stickers on it, which is pretty damn awesome. Um, you do have that slash there. And I don't think that is the original glove from the original movie. But I do like that retro stripe there. Very cool. Got some wear at the top as well. On the spine, you get the title there, and you get the horror sticker, Warner Brothers logo there. Uh, I got Freddy there, Warner Brothers logo at the bottom. And then here is the back, which I think it's the same artwork. And I do have this. Let me see if I can prop this here without the sliding. Ooh, 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 ooh. Let me just take that away. Um, I do have the uh, seven film collection here with the lenticular card. His eyes moving creepy and i'm pretty sure same artwork there on the back that's on the front here like i said and it's not from the, even the original movie either which is weird i got another stand here why am i not using all of the crap that i have here so there's that too but yeah same artwork you have on the front of this cover and it's not even from the original movie um but still pretty cool he's ripping out the packaging there go on the inside you do have your digital download code and you are greeted by your 4k disc in red and it is the same disc that's in the regular release and then here is your inside artwork with freddy there but yeah um i don't know uh i did watch it i think the the darker, um, like the darker parts of the movie, kind of look a little more bluish to me, but um, I think it was still good. They did a really good job, I think, you know, fixing it up. But if you do have the standard set, you know, you know the A Nightmare on Elm Street Blu-ray set, um, I think it's just fine. Um, you don't have to spend a bunch of money on this, but I am wanting Scream Factory to make. A Nightmare on Elm Street set, um, you know, just like they did with the other ones, but like, you know, the Nightmare on Elm Street and all that stuff. Uh, not a Nightmare on Elm Street. Ugh. Friday the 13th. Ugh. I'm still pissed off about <laughs> not getting this in early, but, um, but yeah, I think the standard version, uh, is definitely still good. Um, but I do want Scream Factory to make that set of this movie. Uh, hopefully they do that and hopefully they do that with more uh, sets. I mean, I would like to get a Halloween set from them as well. Um, but, yeah. If you guys are uh, able to pick it up, um, good for you. <laughs> but, 
standard release, a lot cheaper than this one. And if you guys have a Nightmare on Elm Street 7 film collection, I think you're uh, pretty well off, you know, on that set as well. So, yeah. Uh, leave me a comment down below. Let me know if you guys got this still book, if you guys like it or not. Um, if you guys like the 4K transition or, you know, how they fix it up. Um, and you guys just fine with the standard Blu-ray release of all seven films. Um, which I think that's just fine. But yeah, the FOMO on me, I didn't want to miss out on this one. Um, but yeah, leave me a comment below. Let me know what you guys think about this. Uh, which is your favorite A Nightmare on the Street movie? Mine is Dream Warriors. Uh, but yeah. Go follow me on TikTok and Instagram, and make sure you subscribe to this channel. It helps the channel out a lot. Uh, and if you guys do want to purchase, purchase on Amazon if it's still there. Uh, go to our Amazon affiliate link. If you guys want to purchase anything, go to our Amazon affiliate link over there at the bottom. And yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace!